United would quickly start the block with Joe Hugo pinching possession from the Stoke back line in the early stages and he eventually found Isaac Hanson Aaron who confidently powered home from close range to give United a lead within the opening 10 minutes. The Reds double their lead in the 23rd minute as more neat and patient build up play from United saw Matejo Mejia receive the ball on the right and he looked to deliver a ball into the area but his cross deflected off Stokes left back and looped over the visiting goalkeeper and into the far corner. Just after the half hour mark United extended their lead as they continued to press and cause problems for the visitors defence. The ball eventually landed at the feet of Ethan Williams inside the area following a ball in from the right and his left footed strike looped over the Stoke goalkeeper again to extend United's lead. Ethan Williams added a quick fire second and a fourth for United just after the half hour mark. He was set through 1v1 and finished low past the Stoke goalkeeper and finished with power and precision. United continued to dominate and added a fifth in the 40th minute. A ball into the area wasn't cleared properly by the visitors and our number six Max Oyadeli picked up the loose ball from Rage and powered an unstoppable effort into the far corner leaving the Stoke goalkeeper with no chance. On the stroke of half time Stoke pulled a goal back as Willy Comboala unfortunately diverted a low cross across the face of goal into the back of the net. But United soon responded and added a sixth in first half stoppage time as Ethan Williams was played through and then fouled by the Stoke goalkeeper. Joe Hugel stepped up just as he did on Tuesday night but this time he managed to convert directly from the spot as he powered home past the Stoke goalkeeper. Just after the hour mark and United made it seven, Shola Shaw Atere's beautifully weighted three ball finds Mejia who rounded the goalkeeper and slots the ball home. Minutes later and United made it eight, Matteo Mejia turned provider this time as he gets in behind the Stoke defence to lay up substitute Ethan Wheatley, who had only just come on as a substitute just before, and he had a simple tap-in to add an eighth for United. It was soon nine for United, this time Oyadeli with some really neat build-up play on the right flank and he got past his man, delivered a ball into the area and Isaac Hansen aaron was there to unleash an unstoppable left-footed volley past the Stoke goalkeeper, leaving him with no chance. As we approached the final stages of the game, Shola Shuratere was brought down on the edge of the box for a free kick. Sub Sam Mather was keen to pick the ball up and get in on the act as his expertly taken free kick was whipped round the wall and into the back of the net giving United double figures.